Hi, this is Ron Mitchell. We're playing the Hunter Call of Wild on PC today. We're on Parquet Fernando doing some red deer hunting, but we're here to talk about the brand new muzzleloader, uh, which we've seen today on Expansive Worlds live stream. If you haven't seen it, check it out. But we're here to talk about it and just describe what it's all about. It's a 50 caliber Hudzik muzzleloader. It has two types of ammo, which are 50 caliber round ball. And they've got an effective range of 100 meters, penetration of 30 meters, expansion of 30 uh, recommended classes of three to seven and the other round is 50 caliber mini ball these have got an effective range of 200 meters so that's double over the normal round ball penetration of 40 so that's up slightly expansion of 30 and a recommended classes of four to eight it also has a scope which is a four by eight by 32 um, and it looks great <laughs> i can't believe it got a nice pie bold uh, red deer male I haven't actually got one of those in Sasiki Safari Lodge, so we're definitely going to try and bag that while we talk about this uh, muzzle loader. It was teased that there is other things coming as well in the live stream. Um, what that's going to be? A lot of us thought that there'd be three types of muzzle loaders, but um, we're not sure now. But because it could be other stuff, uh, I don't know. So drop in the comments what you think might be added. Because normally, as many people will, uh, know, say, um, there is normally three. Uh, rifles or free weapons in a weapon DLC pack so what else could be included um, there was laughing and giggling a bit uh, and like uh, seemed really excited about one of them in, uh, in particular so what could that be uh, drop that in the comments what do you think will be coming in this package like I say I thought it'd be two different muzzle loaders and then maybe a muzzle loader pistol uh, but I'm not sure about that now. I'm starting to change my mind from what was said in the stream and how they was teasing it. I think it, if it would have been that, they might have said that. So I think we've definitely got something different maybe coming to the game. Which is exciting because like I say, I thought it was just going to be two normal muzzle loaders, an inline, the one that we've got now, and then like a handgun of some kind of uh, muzzle loader. It still might be, I don't know. But... Uh, Based on how they was teasing it, I don't think that is going to be actually what is happening. So yeah, drop in the comments what you think about that. Uh, if you've seen him in action, there was absolutely deadly. No word of a lie. Um, they were shooting animals in the head from 100, 100, 150 meters and they were dead on the spot. So it looks like it's going to be very powerful, especially with the mini ball rounds. 200 meters and that kind of power. Um, it's a good job, really, don't go up to level nine because that's all people. Are, <laughs> that's all people will be using is this uh, uh, muzzle loader. So it's gonna be interesting to see how that is if it gets adjusted or tweaked. We don't know because obviously it's a it's a dev stream and it could get tweaked before it comes out. But how it looks is it looks very powerful and it look not too hard to use. The animations look really nice as well, similar to the classic animations on muzzle loaders. If you've seen that before. Um, you'll know what I mean. Uh, it's very similar to one of the uh, 50 cow ones in the Hunter Classic. The animation is almost identical. So they've done that really well. Uh, someone was saying about, uh, oh, they've got a new caller. It was like a bison caller. And there's, no, that's the black uh, powder flask. But someone thought it was a, a caller for bison, <laughs> which did make me laugh. But obviously, if you don't know, you don't know, do you? So it's, it's coming together nice, it looks, um, looks great, and I think, like I say, a lot of people are going to be interested to get on this. But what is going to be next, I don't know. I was teasing that it was going to be like about two weeks, because Graham said uh, it won't, won't be out for when um, Tree Kiwi's back, and I think he's out in a w back in a week. So it's going to be probably two weeks minimum before that might be out, but he said it wouldn't be long. So I don't think it'll be too long, but I don't think it'll be like this week. So this is where we are. What are you going to be hunting with the muzzle loader when you get them? Uh, drop that in the comments. I am interested to see what you're going to be doing when you get your hands on this muzzle loader or muzzle loaders. What else do you think it could be included in a weapon pack? Maybe it's a theme like clothes from that sort of era uh, and the gun. Uh, and other things, some, but I think there's with something definitely we don't expect in there. Um, someone was on about a blunderbuss in the stream. I don't, I don't think you ever hunted with them, but if did you? I don't know what would you hunt with that. But it's definitely be interested what they might add in the DLC package. And while I've been uh, jabbering away about this muzzle loader uh, coming to Call of the Wild, 
um, we've just nailed that male um, red deer, the piebald, and I'm really happy about that because I've got an albino. Uh, I haven't got a pie, uh, piebald male, and I've, uh, I've got diamond uh, red deer in there as well, so that's a nice trophy addition. I like to try and get everything if I can, of all the different species and rears, and I haven't got one of these, so it's been nice just to come in, uh, luckily get that while we're talking about the muzzle loaders, because I was going to talk about the muzzle loader uh, DLC weapon pack regardless of what we got so it's just a nice bonus we've got that and we've got a nice trophy for Sasiki Safari Trophy Lodge I've been going in strong on the Hunter Classic this week knocked a few videos out on that because uh, I haven't done many videos on Classic for a while so I wanted to get a few few more of those out and then jump back on and try and get a video out for Call of Wild I try and get them in whenever I can and I'm renovating my house I've been saying lately so it's a bit tough to do videos as quick as possible or get them up as as fast as people want uh, me to put them up and do what I'm doing at the minute but I am trying uh, I hope you enjoy the videos uh, I've really been enjoying classic and I'm really enjoying Call of Wild so I mean like uh, best of both worlds at the minute so let's go to Sasiki Safari Trophy Lodge if you want to see anything for both of the games classic or Call of Wild drop it in the comments I'll try and uh, make that for you I've seen a lot of your comments and I do come up with themes ideas based off what you say so make sure you do keep adding what you want to see because I do make videos based on that um, if anyone wants to join me in the hunting friends on the hunter classic as well all you need is a mic uh, just drop it in the comments but today is all about muzzle loaders on Call of the Wild also this piebald male red deer it's been a great hunt and i've really enjoyed it and it's been great talking about the new muzzle loaders coming to call the world i hope you enjoyed the video i'm ron mctube please subscribe to my youtube channels and thanks for watching bye bye